Live from Studio B at Fox Baltimore, Lady T is here, Hi. along with singer artist Moo Moo Fresh. Good morning, ladies. Good What's morning. going on? Good morning. What's up? Happy Monday. <laughs> Happy Monday. Let me tell you right now, a nice start to the week for the Ravens. The team winning their five-week game at home against the Cincinnati Bengals, 19 to 17. The win pushes the Ravens to the top of the North with a three and two record. Moo Moo Fresh, we won, but once again, we squandered a lead. What's going on? We get ahead in every game and we fall behind and almost lose or lose. What's the problem, Moo Moo Fresh? Hey, I, I can't tell you. No, I stick to the things I know about. I stick to music, okay, and activism. <laughs> I'm not gonna tell you no lies now. We need Moo Moo Fresh to come sing down on that field in the yes. second half to clearly. get fired up. Yes, clearly. Lady T, do you know what is going on? Are they distracted by <laughs> Lamar's hairstyle? I mean, what is going on? No, clearly they were distracted by me because I was in the audience with my hair like this. Just kidding. Okay, no, okay. I'm kidding. No, I didn't get to make it to the game. But you know what? I found like I felt like there was like a newfound confidence in them this game and. I'll take it. Even though they blew the lead, I feel like, come on, this is this is a little bit better than what they've been doing, okay? So I'll take it. They look confident. You saw the way he, you know, he was out there. I, okay, I feel like we do need a little bit more help on the field, though. I will say that. But other than that, I'm proud of my Ravens. And they well, about to take on the Giants next week, and I am a Giants fan, too. So well, both my favorites going head-to-head. -head. Well, the crowd was fired up, of course. <laughs> yeah. Uh, you know, we saw... Bray Lewis come out. Hey. We saw, you know, our man from St. Louis, Nelly, come out. <laughs> so it was like yes. the good old days. So he made time. it hot in her. It I was, was so excited. <laughs> okay, so Neil deGrasse Tyson is calling Tesla CEO Elon Musk a modern day Thomas Edison. He goes on to say Musk's dreams big, and that's when big things are bound to happen. Another big dreamer, Moo Moo Fresh. What's your take on Tesla? Is he a modern day Thomas Edison? Huh, he's definitely a visionary, you yeah. know, <laughs> among other things. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, I mean, <laughs> I, I think I'm going to stay on Earth, though. Okay. <laughs> when they go to Mars, I'm, I'm going to stay right here. Right you like, you, I know you, you're hesitating to give me that stamp. Lady T, you give him the stamp? You ain't giving that Edison stamp? <laughs> I guess if Neil deGrasse, deGrasse Tyson says it, I guess it must be true, right? <laughs> but um, it's Elon Musk. I, Following his beef with Twitter, I just want him to get himself together. I just want Elon to get himself together. And I also want him to donate to the Lady T Fund, is oh, what Lord. I really need him to do. I really need him to donate to that. <laughs> I, I would like to afford my own spaceship, but I don't even want to go to space. I just, I just want to have one just to have you just one. Wanna, I think. You just want to like I a just want to have one. I'm, I'm Cardi B. I just want to have one just to have one, okay? Well, we want you to tell it. We want you to tell it. Are you a fan of Elon Musk? Okay. So far, 68% say they are not impressed, but vote on our website, foxbaltimore.com slash vote. It's, it's funny because, uh, okay, it's changing. 70, okay, look, what is, it's moving. Okay, 72%. Oh, wait, wait a minute, it's moving. So go ahead and vote and let us know. All right, now, <laughs> at the end of the show, we'll find out what you're talking about, okay? A seven foot four high school basketball player in France getting the attention of the NBA. LeBron James is calling Victor Wimbanyama, I jacked his name up, a generational talent. Uh, the man who famously helped sign Michael Jordan to Nike says he would give this guy a blank check. Ooh. Mumu Fresh, you have an amazing son. And imagine that. <laughs> this guy, they say a blank check. So wow. let me give you an idea when we talk about uh, shoe deals. So Steph Curry just signed his deal. That's mm -hmm. about $20 million a year. Uh, LeBron, he's around in the same ballpark. Of course, Michael Jordan is the GOAT with $60 million a year in his own brand. What do you think? You know, uh, have, you guys had, have you had a chance to see this guy walk through a, a, a pictures yet? Have you seen him yet? I have not. Mm -mm. So, uh, Moo Moo Fresh, your son <laughs> is about to go into the, uh, you know, he's about to go in, he's, and this guy says it's a blank check. How much are you asking for? What do you think, what's, what's the lowest you would say he could sign for if Steph Curry has a $20 million a year deal? Hmm. Hmm. I mean, a blank check. I, I feel like you should, should ask for what you want, you know? Right, don't cut right. Your, don't sell yourself <laughs> short, you know, the... The future goes forward. So if Steph Curry got 20 million, I'm, I'm thinking a cool 35, you know? <laughs> I, I feel good around there. Lady T, I know, <laughs> Lady T, we know you're all about the Monty. Oh, yes, what? Money? All I really want to see is it. Look, he's in <laughs> high school, and I feel like, I feel like as a high schooler, you know, first of all, him being that tall is amazing. I'm assuming he was five feet when he came out the womb then, <laughs> um, which is fantastic. <laughs> but um, I really do feel like this man, I feel like, okay, if he's going to start off and he's fresh out of high 
high school, I'm thinking maybe 10 mil. Because, I mean, he's not Steph Curry. Wait a minute. He's not LeBron James. Wait a minute. <laughs> oh, he's Lord. not Steph Curry. He's not LeBron James, okay? Uh -uh. He, he was not in Space Jam 2, baby, okay? Okay, Lady T, so I'm we just gotta, you took the low, low ball with that. We gonna, <laughs> it's, so I low balled him, but he'll get you there. You him. It's a buildup. It's a okay, buildup so in Lady life. T, thanks as always. Of course, <laughs> Mumu Fresh, you're gonna join us later on. We'll talk about what you're doing out in these streets. And uh, coming okay. up, <laughs> still ahead of Big